Now, let's count in hundreds from 0 to 1,000. We have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900. And then, if we add another 100 block, that means that we have 10 hundreds. But when we get 10 hundreds, we exchange those for 1,000. So, with the number 1,000, we can imagine 10 hundred blocks stacked on top of each other. Or, if we're counting back from 1,000 to 0, first, we can split or regroup our 1,000 into 10 hundreds. So then, if we take away 100 each time, we get 900, 800, 700, 600, 500, 400, 300, 200, 100, and then 0. We can also show the counting using place value counters. So if we're counting in hundreds, we're adding a hundred counter each time. But then, just like when we have 10 ones, we need to exchange those for one ten. When we have 10 tens, we exchange those for 100. When we have 10 hundreds, we exchange those for 1000. So when we have 10 of any place value, we always move to the place value to the left. So if we have 10 hundreds, that's the same as having 1000. Or to count back, we can exchange our 1000 counter for 10 hundreds, and then counting back in hundreds, we can take away 100 counter each time.